is Rachel Garceau with the Idaho News 6 forecast. Well, good Tuesday morning, everyone. What a change in our weather coming in today. We've had a surface cold front that has moved across our viewing area over the last couple of hours. Now it's coming in almost straight from west to east. So it is dragging cooler air in behind it, but we have seen a warm start to the day because of that surge of warm air we got yesterday. So we're still right now at 58 in Boise, 56 in Twin Falls, and still up around 50, upper 40s from McCall and Ketchum. However, look at the wind that has picked up overnight as well. So anywhere from an 8 to 18 mile per hour breeze in the Treasure and Magic Valleys, just depending on where you're waking up. Just south of Twin Falls in southern Twin Falls County, you can see that spot of yellow that has more significant wind speeds there. So we do have a breezy Tuesday coming our way and temperatures are starting off mild but won't move a whole lot today because of that front and we are seeing radar now picking up a few showers developing across the treasure valley magic valley you've had some sprinkles this morning and we're seeing some very high elevation snow around sun valley so a few spot showers this morning will lead to some stray thunderstorms this afternoon we'll have some sunshine likely mixed in as well so a little bit of everything out there today and that big area of low pressure you see that has moved a little further north over the last 24 hours. That's what's driving this unsettled weather. And it will continue to just pump a couple of disturbances our way over the next few days. So I'm going to pause our future cast at each point here of significance as far as precipitation goes. Stray storms will fire off this afternoon. Here's what we'll wake up to tomorrow morning. 8 to 10 a.m. tomorrow, we'll likely see some rain across the lower elevations. Our mountain valleys will see rain and maybe a rain-snow mix. We'll dry out during the day Wednesday. Look what happens again Thursday morning. In fact, that deeper green you see stretching from McCall through the Boise Mountains and down into the Treasure Valley, that could be a soaking rain at times on Thursday morning. And then Thursday afternoon, we continue to see showers coming and going. And then finally, by early Friday morning, we see all that precip uh, fizzle out and start drying up. And that's also when we'll see a nice little spike in our temperatures coming in. So active weather for the next couple of days. Now today, not an uncomfortably cool day. We'll see low 70s for the lower Treasure Valley, Ontario, Vale, Weezer, upper 60s for Cuna, Boise, and Mountain Home. But we'll have that cool northwesterly breeze and again, the possibility of some thunder storm with some gusty outflow winds and a quick downpour or two this afternoon. Some showers and isolated thunderstorms in the Long Valley today, mid 50s for McCall, Donnelly and Cascade. What a change from the 72 degrees in McCall yesterday. Off and on showers for Stanley with 52 there, 58 for Sun Valley. Windy and a high of 60 in Fairfield with some showers this morning and an isolated thunderstorm potentially this afternoon. And showers and storms and some wind may put a damper on outdoor plans in the Magic Valley as well. It's upper 60 60s there after once again yesterday, Twin Falls got up to about 80 degrees. So cooler still Wednesday and Thursday with those rain showers coming and going. Then we do dry up Friday. We warm up Saturday into the mid-70s. Then we see our next storm system coming in late Sunday.